Hey guys, it's Mac. Um, so recently we just hit 300 subscribers, and I want to say thank you very much for that. Um, so actually, I <laughs> I wasn't I wasn't prepared at all for this. So, um, I think I'm just I don't even have a pa special pack to release for 300 subscribers. So I'm gonna have a pack in the works, but it'll it'll be more like a 300-ish setup. I'm not set up um, special so I think just cuz I don't really know what to do so for part one I'll, uh, I'll just do like a part one or part two part two will be the pack part one um, I think I'll just like release my uh, mods folder just these, these mod, my mods folder um, I'll showcase them in this video so you guys know what, they're, what I'm doing with them uh, I'll showcase the mods uh, I'll just release the mods folders. Um, uh, disclaimer: none of the mods that I made, in, none of the mods in my folder are made by me. Sorry. I I may be good at packs, but I don't know how to code mods. So all credit goes to the original mod creators, which I'm pretty sure should be like when you install, be there when you install the mods. But anyway, so um, I think I'll also I'm also gonna release my pack showcase world because. I've had a few people on Discord ask me for it, and uh, I was like, oh, uh, okay, sure. Might as well just do it here in case there's more people asking for it. And it'll also, it'll also include the command of how I made my villager, my showcase villager that I bully all the time. But that's okay, because he has no feelings. Okay, anyway, so first mod, uh, I use Forge for my mods. That's quite obvious, Forge. Mouse delay fix, I don't... I mean, it just does something. I don't exactly know what it is though, but it'll help. It help. It helps with like I think it helps with like the mouse when you move from like the block to block, like the block over block, um, like the thing that selects the block. Anyway, next mod I have old animations mod. It's not that. This mod. It's for my 1.7 animations and um. These are my settings. If you want to uh, copy them, I mean, most people probably have this. This one is not the orange Marshall one. This is the one by like Spider Frog or something. Uh, and just so you know, oh yep, yeah, by Spider Frog. And just so you know, um, when you use this, I'd recommend having toggle sneak off. I just have this. This is just double tapping for sprint, but that doesn't matter. I'd recommend having this off because I don't know what this might do. I mean, maybe toggle sprint is fine, but it's toggle sneak. I don't know about that. Um, direction HUD. I mean, I guess you could use that if you want. But uh, anyway, next mod we have keystrokes, which in the like the corner up here. Well, it would be in the corner here, but keystrokes, and you access this by slash keystrokes mod keystrokes. There you go. Change the background stuff my settings if you want to copy my settings for whatever reason just use plain settings so I don't like so everything matches with whatever pack I'm using oh okay and then this mode changes between like here here's the it shows the right left and right click it shows a space bar doesn't show them at all uh, toggle CPS CPS uh, toggle FPS so all of is the FPS chroma chroma fade time it's like can't show it, but it it just when you click it fades out, whatever that is. Next one, perspective mod. Uh, it's like in in like cheat breaker or probably most um, PVP clients right now. Like if you just you can press a keyboard a key on your keyboard and then it'll be like a better F5 almost. You can spin around. That's how it. Like I showcase a sky spin around. That's how I do that. And I also press F8. Cinematic camera, but then that's a thing that's already in normal Minecraft. Then to turn it back, you just press the key again. Mine is set to uh, where is it? Mine is set to F right here. You can make this whatever you want. Default is by, by default it's also F. Um, perspective mod, armor HUD, armor. It's like uh, the armor HUD is down here. HUD, I think. Yeah, there it is. Enable it. Status. Like, have the armor. You can also move it around and stuff. Um, 
group just to align them. Durability, you can show the durability, different ways of showing the durability. Uh, right sided, left sided, I like that. I, I just keep it off because I don't think I need it. Um, because like I just usually show the bar right there. Uh, regroup vertical, like that. Um, the durability bar enabled, that's like when it takes damage. Uh, mo edit the modules, I guess you can probably change stuff, but. Next, we have uh, cord pwns cord hud. I have not a lot of pwns mods. I just realized cords hud. It's like up here. A lot of people in UHC use it. Chat. I don't know what that does. Vertical. Yeah, that way. That way. Um, shadow text. I mean, it just makes it a little. This is like a slight difference between the text. And let me make it bigger. So there's a slight difference in the text. Shadow it honestly makes it makes it better. Got it like 70. There we go. Direction is enabled. Like southwest. Uh, mm -hmm. Then biome. Show the biome. Details. Background, just the background. Coordinates. Well, obviously coordinates. Prefix. Uh, I think that's like this thing. The direction. Ah, display of skin like that for me save turn next next mod we have potion hud it'll show well obviously it'll show your potion effects it's like this is right here um, you can edit effects like change the color of the duration they're like uh, just press on one and they go here and you can also make it roman numerals or regular numbers, I like Roman numerals. Under the icons, icons or no icons, showing chat, I guess, showing if you have it. Effect level is above four. I mean, if it's above four, it's gonna show. Like right here. There, there's my speed. Next. Next mod, after that, sidebar mod. Um, well, let me just go on high pixel. sidebar you can have the background like you can see the background or you can't see the background just a little bit mm -hmm. this is just basically one, one of the things this does is takes away those red numbers that's one of the important things that it does uh, shadow I guess that probably puts shadow on the text so that probably makes it better um, enabled and yep next mod is auto GG, which after you finish game, it will say GG. Auto tip, it just auto automatically slash uh, tips in on high pixel. Phone fix, that's so just an FPS mod. Memory fix, I guess, helps with the memory or something. And this vanilla enhancements slash an e config. There we go. It's just, um, Enhancements for like things like um, change chat length, show ping of other players in tab. Um, mm, players column, try make tab transparent if you want. Uh, do not move inventory. Oh, yeah, this this is helpful. This one's really helpful. Uh, show current protection when opening in the inventory, like right there. Uh, whoops. Stupid. Anyway, hide boss bar. Yeah, most of you. By now, most people probably use some at least one of these mods. Oh, and obviously, I have Optifine, so I can do that. Um, opens up more video settings, uh, video settings, stuff like this. And yeah, I think, and that's gonna be it. And my, the world download will be in the description. Um, you'll probably have the same loadout as I do right now, something like this, but yeah, that's it. Hope you guys enjoy it, and see ya.